G'day Tankers and welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm Stemio21 and today I am bringing you a battle in my IS-8, or is it a T-10? The story behind that is that the T-10 and the IS-8 are the same tank. They're pretty much exactly the same. The IS-8 was a designation um, just before Stalin died and before it was brought into production the IS-8 had a rename to the T-10 after Stalin died. Uh, so there you go, a little bit of tank trivia for you. Thank you, courtesy of the World Tanks Wiki and Wikipedia. I know you don't, you don't have to trust those, but they can't both be wrong. And I'm, I've read some other sources that confirm that as well. Anyway, um, as you can see, you were on mines. I think that's what this uh, one's called. I can never remember. Um, going for the hill as I've always believed, and I'm, I think I'm not alone uh, knowing this, is the um, the hill is the most strategic resource on the map. Um, if you control the hill, you control the battlefield and you'll uh, have a higher chance of winning. Which is all what we love to do. Okay, so, tier 10 match, um, I wanted... No, I wanted... Half the team is 8s and... Uh, sorry, 9s, and the other half is 10s. So, with a couple of 8s per team as well. So, again, I shot on an object 140. Bounce a shot from him as well. Um, this this Jaeger is being a bit of a dick, getting in my way when I'm trying to retreat, but oh well. Someone from behind has shot me, looks like the Centurion, but he's actually bounced as well. Uh, tried to get a shot on that E4. I really hate those tanks because every time I shoot at them, and this is in other battles as well, I seem to friggin' miss. But anyway. That's because I play with Russian guns. Um, yeah, about the IS-8, because this, this is a bit of a slow part of the map and game so far, so I'll just talk about the tank. Um, I really don't like this tank in some ways, and I really love it in other ways. The things I hate, um, it, it's a bit slow to turn, it's a bit slow to accelerate, the armor's pretty average unless you side scrape properly, which depends on my care factor and also my level of sleep that I've had. Um, things I like, the, the turret is really bouncy, which is nice, and the gun is amazing. It's got a 10 second reload and it hits for 440 damage average, and with a 258 um, penetration. Yeah, about that. But anyway, um, basically right now we're jostling for positions on the top of the map. Um, I keep firing this guy's top cupola, which I have penetrated before in other tanks, but I just can't seem to hit it for the life of me. Um, you'll probably notice I'm using food um, in my ISA at the moment. Um, I've actually switched back to a um, automatic fire extinguisher because I, got I set fire a couple of times and it kind of hurt. Um, also, I've just made a mate constantly run food on it, so I need to wait for a sale, so um, I buy some some food. Um, I actually missed one, but I wanted to buy a tank, so I bought a tank instead of food. That's okay, though. Um, yeah, again, this this tank, this this battle's really slow to start with. Um, just not not what happens at first, but I, I promise you, you will not be disappointed. It gets quite good. So we've bounced a fair few shots. It looks like that um, Centurion Seven One though is firing HE. Yes, he is. I don't know why. Does he think it will pen me better? I don't know. Um, I personally don't fire HE in any of my tanks anymore. I keep one for resetting the cap and that's about it. Unless I see a, um, a waffle and I want to kill him in one shot. And that is entirely possible. Um, I shot that E4 with an AP around the turret. That, that was silly. The front of the turret is pretty tough. I should have switched to a heat round if I wanted to do that. I'm taking a wasteful shot. I'm wasting shots at this this point because, but I guess I guess I'm doing something useful by keeping people's hands down. I take a massive wallop from that IS-7, which really hurts. Um, yeah, we'll get him. Don't you worry. But um, yeah, just. Again, it, not a lot's happening. It's it's quite of a slow game. I'm really worried about sni snipers on the hill or tank destroyers, depending on your um your preference on what they want to call them. Um, 
I'm just waiting for him to be distracted because I don't I don't want to go out and take another hit. I'm going. I'm, I may need my health. I may need to carry. You never know. I think it's a lot of a mistake a lot of players um, do these days is they um, decide they, they trade health for health basically, um, and that's not necessarily a good idea. So as you can see, we're going to get him. Remember, guys, lower plate. So there we go, we've done 1,000 damage, which isn't wonderful, but we're going to do more. Um, so we're going to try, we're going to wait for us to not be spotted anymore, and we're going to pop up. Now, that ca if you can, if you can see in the bottom right hand corner of the map, you can see the KV-4, um, he's just sitting there, and I, I can tell you right now, and because I'm not going to, I'm not going to kill him, uh, he's, he's going to be there until the end of the battle. He just sits there. Anyway... So, yeah, we're now on the hill. Uh, well, now I'm on the hill, um, which is actually really great. Although this side's um, taking a pounding. Um, they, they've lost pretty much everyone that's gone down there. They've just lost to the Centurion. And they've got the E4 that's left. And they've got a T34, two T34 sorry, against them. And there is a Waffle um, there as well. Um, more on him later. Uh, the funny thing is, actually, uh, one of those T-34s comes around later, and we'll show, you'll see what happens to him. Um, so, Centurion, I can't do much for this guy, against this guy, he's behind rocks. Um, but as you can, as you can see, from the hill, you can sort of just move around it, and you can take shots that you wouldn't normally be able to take, because you've got the high ground. Um, yeah. What else about the IS-8? I really don't like the gun depression, it's got 5 degrees of gun depression, and I could have sworn that the IS-8 had more. Yeah, I always felt as if I could take my shots a lot easier. It's been a challenge to use this tank, um, which is nice, I don't mind a challenge, but it's been a bit, it's been quite difficult playing this tank. We landed, another, we landed a hit into the side of that Yay Tiger 88, he doesn't turn around. I don't know why, I would have, if I'd been him, I would have turned around and got against that, um, that rock. But, yeah, he continues to leave his uh, side open to us, so we take another shot at him, and he's taken out by our Waffen Tractor Panzer IV. Um, yeah. Bit of an explanation of what I've been doing, um, the last month or a bit since I've, well, it's probably been more than that since I've played a video. Um, combination of a couple of things. Um, I've been working a lot recently um, with my real life job. Um, just, just been very busy. Uh, from what, from who you, what if you don't know, uh, I work in a uh, IT department um, for a superannuation company, and um, it's, it takes a lot of my time up. And then I've got family as well that I like to spend time with, so this this usually takes um, second second base. Um, also, I've been quite sick as well. I've, I've had I had influenza for about a week of my hiatus, and it's not been good for me. So this T thirty four, he it was probably silly of him to come around, but what could he do? Um, I was taking apart his team from the hill, so he had to do something. For all he knew, I could have been some stupid scrub, and I, and I am. Don't get don't get me wrong. Uh, I could have been some stupid scrub, and he could have got the, sh the drop on me and just taken me out. So yeah, so we're talking about so we've got two kills, which is nice. We've got three thousand one hundred and sixty-eight damage so far, which is a good game for me uh, in this. But we're not done there. We're going to crack that uh, orphan trailer again, but we miss, but he misses as well as thankfully, he misses again. I do horrible, horrible things to this um, orphan trailer. I, I should have loaded um, HE, in my opinion. I might have done some serious damage. We do another hit to him, which is nice. Artoi's splashing him as well. He's, uh, from what I can tell, a one-shot. He's a potential one-shot. Now he's a one-shot. No, not quite. We rolled a little bit higher than our average damage there, which was good. Um, pretty much left. All that's left is this um, KV-4, which yep, he's still there. Um, that's not 
It's a bit sad, really, but what can you do? And someone was a bit sad and was like, it wasn't a good game at all. But oh well. We all have bad games, but yeah. So, yeah, 4,096 damage. That's not bad for me. Um, and that's the end of the game. Um, so not a massively exciting game at the first, but they got more interesting to the end. Um, I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, how about we look at the post-game stats? And to my surprise, that was my mastery badge. Um, that was a pretty good game. Um, although I didn't think it was mastery quality, but obviously um, people aren't doing as good in this tank. So, um, 73,000 uh, credits received, 33 profit, um, 2,050 experience, which is nice. Two, ki uh, did two kills, damage to a fair few tanks, spot a couple. Um, 2,751 spawn damage and 4,096 of my own damage, which is pretty good. Um, top in the XP, which is good. Uh, I hit a lot of tier 10s, I think, which was good. Also got top damage on our team, and also out of the enemy team as well, which is very nice. Um, a bit of a shout out to these couple of guys at the top. They obviously really fought, especially these two. He, he did his fair share, the Centurion. Um, and he did pretty well in the IS-7, not though these guys are starting to slow down, but no one did zero damage on that team, which is really good. Um, detailed report, uh, 17 shots fired, only 13 hit and 11 penetrated. Um, as I said, damage is 4,096, um, hits received is 8, penetration is 5, non penetration is 3, and uh, one special damage hit. Yeah, um, pretty all round uh, good game. And uh, 2000. So I'll just zoom in because I can't quite see that on my screen. Uh, that's 2751 spawning damage. That's not bad. I I'm actually really pleased with that. Um, anyway, it's time for me to go. So I'll see you next time. Bye.